Uh, welcome to the show. Uh, Thank you for having me. Yeah, uh, this is your this is your talk show debut. First time. First wow, time. this is. I'm I'm honored. I'm it's, honored. It's it's quite surreal. Yeah. Um, actually, this is not the first time we met though. So so eight years ago when I first moved to New York and we met eight, we've met each other. Eight years ago, yeah. Uh, this is when I was still del delusional with with uh, with the pipe dream of acting and. I was, I had just moved to New York and I was walking through Gramercy to play ball on the east side. And you were in the garden um, talking to some woman with a stroller and we made eye contact through the black gate. And we just kind of like, <laughs> I was just like with my ball and just smiling like. <sighs> and then you were just staring at me pensively and we locked eyes for like a prolonged, like couple seconds. <laughs> like a, a weird recognition of sorts and then uh, I just walked away thinking like, wow, one day if I ever get a chance to tell Jimmy this story, I'll, I'll, I'll do that. And it's crazy that... <laughs> I have weird. a feeling. It's weird. I had a feeling it's about weird, you. Guys. Yeah, when I saw you, I go, he's going to be big. You're going to be big one day, kid. <laughs> yeah, I was giving uh, you the vibes. I go, hey, stick with it, pal. I'm like, what is this guy looking at? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what is he doing? Yeah. yeah. Uh, when you moved to New York with the, 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 the goal, acting, this is what I want to do. Yeah. Yeah, and how, how, what was that ride like? Trials and tribulations. Uh, yeah. Kind of went through the grind, learned how to, you know, eat, sleep for dinner and, and things like that. But then uh, New York, uh, it, this, you know, the spirit of New York kind of opened up its, uh, herself. And I, there was a lot of serendipity that just carried me through like seven years of, 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 a, of a concrete jungle grind. Did you get any gigs before uh, Beef? Yeah, I mean, I did. I worked with like, all the universities, like student films, indie films, short films, a lot of films I hope nobody ever finds, and, and <laughs> a number of performances I hope no one ever sees. Uh, so I, it, it's kind of felt like a f failing upward trajectory. Yeah. You know, to but, get to uh, I, but I read somewhere, I thought that, that you maybe thought about quitting acting because you're like, well, I don't know if I'm going to do oh, it. Yeah, yeah. I don't know I if mean, it's going to work out. Numerous amount of times. I, th I, think, I think one needs delusion to pursue acting and to stay the course, but. Uh, I just I just got to a point where um, I did enough psychedelics to kind of realize um, <laughs> to realize like am I happy pursuing this? Am I the same person um, when I started and, and trying to main, like trying to reevaluate re where my happiness truly lies and whether that's in the craft uh, or, or or Hollywood? Uh, yeah. Were your parents uh, supportive in this uh, decision? No, no. Uh, and, uh, sorry, initially no, but but. I just remember the dinner, <laughs> we were having dinner and I just, I was like my, in my fifth year of college flailing and I, and I, mind you, my dad has like five masters, he's PhD and he's very, uh, education is key to him and that's how he, you know, supported his whole family. And I remember we were eating and I was like, I'm gonna drop out of college, move to New York. I had nothing lined up, I didn't know anything. I was Googling how do you become an actor and they were like, you gotta be, be in New York or LA. And I just remember the way my dad like put his spoon down and the way he kind of sat back and it was like this resignation of like, God damn it, like. <laughs> <laughs> I did everything yeah, yeah. I could. Like this guy, this, this kid. kid is gonna yeah. kill me, yeah. man. Yeah, he's yeah. like, yeah. gosh, we're so close yeah. to yeah. making a perfect human. Yeah, and I just kind of went. <laughs> and you went the other way. Yeah. But now you're on Beef and everyone's talking about it. It's one of the top 10 shows of all Netflix. <laughs> Yeah. Giant hit. Yeah. You're fantastic in it. Thank you. And what 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 is what do they think now, mom and dad? Well, well, I showed my parents, my family, the early screeners, so, so they watched the whole thing. And then my my dad called, and he doesn't really call me often. And he's he's a man of few words, and he's like, "Young, you're a good actor." Nah. Yeah, so that kind of. You know, Dude, that's all you want. Yeah. That that. That's like, all. Yeah. That's all you want. You get that from Dad. I love that. And uh, you're getting uh, early buzz on uh, Emmy nominations. I don't know if you're if you're hearing any of this or all that stuff, but it's well deserved. I mean, you're 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 a breakout hit. Yeah, but I will have to say that a lot of my performance is because of it's due to you know set design, the lighting, the the scene partners that I had: Stephen Young, Ali Wong. Oh yes, yeah, uh, Ali uh, Wong. Yeah. yeah, showrunner Lee Sung Jin, aka Sunny, who's also a brilliant writer, uh, creator. So. You know, a lot of my performance, I think, is just due to them providing so much and being so generous with, with their energy. And, yeah. Um, Good team. I, I, I'm, I'm, I'll take it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Thank you. I want to show a clip. Here's young Mazzino in Beef. Take a look. We should go sometime. Harbor? 
Oh, it's sick. Oh, they just ride taboo towers. You go one way up, three ways down. It's unpredictable. Kind of like how I live my life. Anyways, I, I do investing. This is like my side gig. So if you ever need investing in life, um, I'll, I'll be right back. Okay. Yo, you done yet? I would be if you're helping me instead of flirting with the customer base. Dude, it's called client services. Do not text on the job. Who is that? Her name's Kayla. She's bad, right? This is a bot. You're a bot. <laughs> You're a bot. Young Mazzino. Beef is streaming now on Netflix. Hey, hey.